A shocking diagnosis, breast cancer, if not one but both breasts. Now one local woman is hoping by signing up for a clinical trial, she'll help other women in the future. ABC's Ashley James reports. Yes, the other one. Jeanette Brown found the lump herself. I did a self-exam. Felt the small one in the, my left side, but the right side, I just kept going over and over to make sure I was feeling what I was feeling. Tests would confirm Jeanette had cancer in both breasts. It was stage two. For any woman finding out that they have, have that, it was, it was pretty devastating. But Jeanette knew she needed to stay strong for her daughter. My daughter's disabled and she depends on me. She needs me, so I have to be strong for her. I definitely have to be strong for her, and the only thing that she understands is that mommy was sick. With family by her side, Jeanette would go on to have chemo first, followed by a double mastectomy and radiation. When we're worried that it might be more advanced stage, we jump in right away with chemotherapy, and that allows us to see the, chemo the cancer actually shrink, as we did with her. We could feel it shrinking. How about with the regular hormone blocking pill? Dr. Ivan Ottaviano, Chief of Medical Oncology and Director of the Breast Oncology Program at MedStar Franklin Square Hospital, says Jeanette also became part of a clinical trial. She was gracious enough to uh, sign up for a clinical trial where half the women have just the standard hormone blocking pill after all of this, but the other half get the standard treatment plus another pill, in this case a pill called Ibrance which we know um, is more effective than just the regular hormone blocking pill in patients with more advanced stages of breast cancer. I decided to get into clinical trials so I could help other women. Dr. Ottaviano says they are hopeful that adding the second pill will give women with early stage breast cancer a better long-term outcome as well. For ABC2 News, I'm Ashley James.